Last week, Neymar committed the ultimate transgression. He broke the golden rule. Double denim! I think he's too intense. So Neymar, he tried to take a penalty from Edison Cavani. And I haven't seen Cavani with his finger this tight since Gonzalo Hara tried to shove his finger up his arse. And now comes the news that Cavani is ready to turn down a 1 million euro backhand to give Neymar all the penalties. Which proves not only does he have the worst hair in football, but he's also monumentally stupid to boot. Clearly, Neymar is the boss now, and Cavani is just staving off the inevitable. Come on, Edison, take the L. Seriously, I can only imagine Neymar's reaction when he wanted to take that penalty, and he turned around and Cavani is there with the ball on the spot. Who the fuck is that guy? Who the fuck is that? No damn well who I am. Who the fuck is that? Take the hint, Edison. They're not going to take your side against Neymar anymore. He's got a dressing room full of Brazilian colleagues, including his little bitch, Danny Alves. At the back for for Leon tonight. But how did anyone else expect it to go any different? This is not PSG. This is NSG. That N for Neymar. PSG are promoting one player at the expense of all others, Cavani included. Now, this strategy has worked before at Barcelona in the case of Lionel Messi. But Messi is Messi. Neymar still has to prove himself, not only to the watching world now, but also to a very, very skeptical dressing room. Who thought it was a good idea to drag five or six Paris Saint-Germain players into one room and tell them that they're all facing the sack because Neymar has to be paid? This is a new PSG, and there may not be any eye in team, but there certainly is one, and get on your bike, Cavani. Cavani has put up a roadblock, but the sooner he takes it down, the better. Is it fair? Well, no. But then again, it wasn't fair when the likes of Nene and Sacco and Shantum were kicked out in their arses to make room for the first wave of signings either. The bad news is, some of you will lose your jobs. Yeah, yeah. No, I know, I know. Gutting, gutting. The good news is, I've been promoted. This isn't football. This is showbiz. So now opponents might well have a new strategy to apply some pressure on PSG. Foul one of them in the box and see what chaos it brings on. Don't bully man. So let's recap what PSG achieved last season with Edison Cavani as their star attraction. They finished second in a one-horse race in Ligue 1 and they got put out of the Champions League in the most humiliating circumstances possible. By who? Neymar. So, Edison, if you were that good in the first place, mate, they wouldn't have spent 400 million on two strikers to replace you. 